I'm going to pick this up. You can keep that horse in a little bit further here. And I'll get it on the other side of this drape. I just say. Oh, okay. Yeah, there So, okay. other, way, other way, we're just going to fight them chokers trying to get them out. Yeah. Oh, what you got? Just a jet. All right, come on up a little more. All right, that's good. Okay. Set her down. All right. Come and get this, because this one is heavier. What you think is this? Because you're all, you're all close to the pier. Yeah, that one was significantly heavier yeah, than the other one. I picked this end up. I set it heavy. An eighth higher than this? I'm, I'm or? the same as I am over there. Okay, this. so this one's level, but th both yeah. of these are an eighth inch higher than that, that one. corner over there. Me too. Are you serious? Yes, sir. Can't be. So both logs are perfectly level, but that one's an eighth inch higher than this one. How did I do that? I don't never do that. It's all enough to clear everything? I think too. When I set the seal log on our cabin that I'm building it on our place, somebody had made a suggestion to cut the anchor rods a couple of inch shorter, kind of staggered down to make it easier to set the, the seal log. And we did that here. I cut this one on the D wall corner, 18 inches. And I cut the one in the middle at uh, 16 inches. And I cut this one on the B-wall corner 
at 14 inches and it was really easy to set the sill logs we didn't have to try to uh, get all three rods in the holes at the same time it worked really really well and whoever that was i do not remember i do want to thank you for that suggestion because it worked great 